smoking chaos. Our shoulder blades kissed. I found you. We're gonna try to catch the train now to the middle of Lisbon. <laughs> When I think of European city street, if you type that into Google, I feel like that's what you get right there. That's so cool, bro. Dude, it's <laughs> raining out of nowhere. It really did. It was really sunny, but now it's raining. Darks, what is that called? Arco de Rua Augusta. That actually sounded yeah, really not cute. Bad. Wait, is Arge de Rua Augusta <laughs> the, the clock thing or the thing behind it? It's the Arge. Okay. Yeah, it's the Arge. That's Arge de Rua El Gesta. Atlantic Ocean. Or as Noah would say, Pacific. Pacific Ocean. Yeah, I think that's the Pacific Ocean. You can see the castle way up there. We're gonna go there in a bit. Just European architecture is so cool to me because it's so much different than everything that I'm used to. We should be able to read what it says on the statue. October 18th, 1833. I'm assuming that's what Otto Bro means. <laughs> yeah, that's probably a good guess. Right? That's the cathedral. Imagine building that in the 1200s. I just got offered weed. <laughs> Twice. There's lots of like interesting type people here. Lots of suspect people. But it's kind of fun. <laughs> Alright, we are halfway through the first day. And my synopsis is that my calves and my shoulders are going to be massive at the end of this trip because <laughs> this bag is already weighing down even though it's only 20 pounds <laughs> and all of the walking is going to be insane especially in Lisbon, it's quite hilly We made it to the castle I found you I found you beautiful I found you explode My question is, did the king and queens just like chilling here <laughs> why is there no structure for them to like hang out in I found you I found you you like the castle Darsh yeah this is nice bro day one going quite well so far a little shaky okay. start but we're vibing now yeah <laughs> also we've only spent like 10 euros the entire day We've been walking a lot. Yeah. One euro train ticket and seven euros to get in here. So Champions Day got mini croissant, latte, espresso, and a banana and some fitness, chocolate fitness bar. <laughs> oh, day two. We made it to Porto. <laughs> We are going to the cathedral and then we're gonna to go to this bookstore that looks like it's straight out of Harry Potter. I found you. I found you. I found you beautiful. I found you exploding. Five euros to get into the Catholic Church. The Catholics, man. <laughs> they tax it for real. We're not gonna go in though, because we're about to spend eight euros on the bookstore. So that's our excursion fee for today. It's known as the Harry Potter bookstore because J.K. Rowling lived in Porto and she was inspired by the place to describe the bookstore in the movie. I found you. I found you. I found you. It's cool, but the question is, is it worth the eight euros? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you think so? Me, personally, I don't think so. The Imperial McDonald's. Like, if I don't... <laughs> then you realize it's going to be That's the cathedral. <laughs> there are people up there. There's people up top. Why can't we go up top? Now we're the ones that are up here. <laughs> I found you beautiful. I found you exploding. I found you.
out your heart You're pulling yourself apart Boat tour of the guy that made the Eiffel Tower allegedly made that bridge Factor cap, what do we think Darsh? Fact, <laughs> lucky We sweat bleeding down, I found you Windy. Castle. Yep, Rito. We're at the Moorish Castle today. It's we took the train from uh, Porto this morning to Lisbon, and then we took a train here. Yeah. It's very windy. up here for a couple minutes taking you to the picture of the scenery. Look at the state you got this place. go throughout the whole castle for free and that's going to conclude this portugal video thanks for following along and you should go to portugal it's fire <laughs> shout out darsh